but uh, the wife told me I'm supposed to say something now because apparently there's some people in here that it might be past their bedtime. Oh, is there any truth to this? Oh, it's oh, it's seven thirty. It's dark. And obviously, I only had one you know, for big drinks tonight. Hey, and obviously, give me give me another jack. I need some jack right now. <laughs> obviously, the melatonin is flowing. <laughs> We're here because Obi's leaving. Who gives a fuck? <laughs> yeah, they were telling you about time. You know, and just to start off on a real positive note, he's lucky he married G, who was on the village board. Hey! At least, he, at least he was smart enough to do that. You just said I was stupid. Well, I just said so you not, Well, now I can at least show you. The wife took pity on you, you know, which is a good thing because I know the wife took pity on me many moons ago. Amen. How? <laughs> Who said amen? Who said amen? That was a public employee. Oh, Ina? No. That's right. You're, you're a professional volunteer for summer celebration, even though... But in any event, I don't know, he came here, what about it? Is it 15 years? 15 years ago, which would have been... 01. 01. <laughs> only four years. 14 years. Oh, okay, okay. In, in PGA talk, it's 15 seasons. 15 seasons, okay. and a half years. Okay. And, and if you enjoyed any of them? No, none of them like any of them. Because you've been so rude. Yes. I know. Not the magic condescending. Yes. Not the mention of pit bands. Just to let you know, and my biggest teacher is the one doing it. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Oh, hey, he had none of these propensities. The only thing him and I have in common. I'm from the south side of Chicago. He's from, like, you know, South Carolina, so I guess that's further south. He lived, he's going to move back into a state. I'm getting serious. I see that. He's got, where they didn't drop the flags. For who? Who did they drop the flags for? Rosa Parks. So he's going back there, you know? You know, he grew up on a plantation. Right? So, don't, make, don't make me go there. Hey, I'm going there. He goes there for 15 years. And I said, why do you think I moved to Vernon Hills? Because you don't let many of them live. I 
Yes, sir. You're making, you're making shit up. You never thought. Yes, sir. I did. I did know one thing that you know that he had some decent raisins. And then, you know, you know, look at that man, that's shit, you know. <laughs> like looking in the damn mirror. Jesus Christ. But uh, I will, do want to say one thing. He, he, he's always been a great friend. He's always had a lot of fun. He's always, he's, he's always done more, more than his hard work and make sure that we all, we all had a good time. And, uh, 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 and, 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 and this place was open when we wanted it to. And we, did our pop bucks and we did this, did that. He was always more than more than support to all of us. So let's give him a big hand. More than more than support to all of us. So let's give him a big hand. Tomorrow yeah. night, baby. Yeah. Notre Dame will prevail. Tomorrow yeah. night. We will be watching uh, the Domers going to Death Valley about 7.30 tomorrow night if anybody oh, cares to join us after the golf outing. I already said I wanted to go to this this year. What is it? Tell them what it is. My oldest friend is a Gamecock. I'm pulled for Clemson. And I said, you know what? I was going to call him when I got down there and say, we have to go to the Clemson Carolina game this year, and now we got two teams. Aww. Thank you. Thank you. Well, 15 years ago, I came in here and tried to get some free golf, and you weren't, you weren't happy. You got your ass kicked early. <laughs> well, what, why were you asking? Well, no, I just remember Ron O'Brien. No, he was misbehaving, and I told him, you better cut the shit out of him and Justin. He goes, I don't have to listen to you, because my grandfather works here. Yeah. Oh, he, he was playing the grand. Yeah, he tried. Yeah. Why not? Why he not? tried. It didn't work. Okay. Well, I just wanted to say, though, over these 15 years, you've taught me yard shit talking, especially on the golf course. You've played a lot of fun rounds. We've had a lot of good times in here. The past few years, you've allowed me to sort of work here unofficially, and uh, that's allowed me to enjoy my hobby while uh, still maintaining a decent savings account. So I appreciate that, Obi. And on behalf of the Wall Rams, Frank can't be here right now. Oh. I'd like to thank you for the time you put in here and for making it uh, such a good experience for everyone involved. I'm here all the time, every time I'm out there. So I sincerely appreciate that you reached out to me and us and that you were very welcoming and even though I sucked. And helped me to get better at what, what I was trying to do and accomplish and made me really appreciate golf, not just from a, a serious perspective, but from a goofy perspective, because you're, you're freaking goofy. <laughs> hey, you led the Muni in. You and, Joe, you and Joe Killian still lead the Muni in cursing, so you might as well relax and have a good time. There you go. Earl. Hey, we're gonna, you're going to be retiring soon. You're going to work for your husband. Come down to Charleston about once a month. It'll all be good. We'll get it all worked out. We're all going to miss you. I know I haven't been able to golf, but coming down here, you're sitting and talking you with here. you guys. I know I was, and that didn't work out. But I wish you and Jeannie and Gail, because she's going. They're stuck on her. are here. You still talk to me after bringing him in there, but it turned out to be a nice family now. Yeah. You still accept me. Well, you you know, know I love him like a brother, right? You want to know the best Breck story? Oh, uh, uh, yes, we, we yes. go. Two things at Prairie Landing. Uh -huh. we'll, we'll skip the first one. The second one was I tried to help him. Uh -huh. No, 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 I'm not. Nothing. So I walked away from him on 18. He goes, what's the matter? I'm like, well, you ain't listened to me all day. What difference does it make now? <laughs> but then, at the range, Rich Bricks decided to sneak his own range balls in instead of paying $8 for a bucket of balls. And I said, you will never go with me again if you do that again. <laughs> yes, you did. Hey, you know, hey, balls, hey, you Rich, and you were bragging about it. You gave me. And you were bragging about it. And was frugal. He's, oh, my God. Really? 
bragging about oh. bringing your own oh. rings balls because you didn't want to pay eight bucks for a bucket. Right. I said, yeah. you will never come with me again with a, my name on the group. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She moved down my block. I didn't know Gail existed, and he wasn't even here. So fast forward. He's my new friend, <laughs> along with Gail and Jeannie. So here's a card. Thank you. Okay. So uh, last hmm, May, we are all going to come go somewhere, like six of us, and go watch the. Black oh box. yeah, the pimp ass out of you, Patricia. <laughs> oh my God, you're the one person that has made me be a pimp ass. <laughs> this is a wish you were here while well, Patricia yeah. went to the Stanley Cup clinching game and kicked us to the curb because she was supposed to hang out with us. She had better stuff to do. Yeah, that morning I'm finding out where we're going to meet and what I'm going to bring to share. And at 403, I find out I can have a ticket and get down to the Blackhawks game. So that's pretty sweet. She did, don't worry. She did. Teachers do that. They said he didn't catch anything he got needed. No, and then open that. So the card says he wasn't too lucky and that I obviously got to go to the game and I got snuck this picture for him on the golf course, which is hard to get Obi smiling in a picture. He's got, his, <laughs> he's got his hands on his hip and I had printed on it, happy days are coming. And then it says, just how lucky can you get? It's been a long time. Are we passing that around? <laughs> no, that would be a bottle of two women. <laughs> Hey, I'm going. The other, just the other night at Patricia's, I got four women, or three women. It's like hell. I'm going Brother. to be kind of a disappointment going to only two down the yeah, I mean, so we're just, going to Missouri. This is New Clarus. He likes New Clarus beer. Last month I was in Wisconsin. So. Thank you. Here's the other five. We'll keep drinking. <laughs> Thank you, dear. Thank you. Come here. Yeah. Yeah. Apparently, we need Lisa Lampanelli <laughs> and uh, what's his name, Ross, and maybe Bussy, David. What's his name? Well, I didn't piss off as many people as you. Thought. No, you didn't even. You. Roger, I got to yeah. Okay. <laughs> you know, you don't want me to start. <laughs> You want me to start with the people that don't like you? Wrap it up, our batteries are going dead. Roger, they're only here because you're buying the nice No, 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 no. I mean, it, this they is, had to buy their own shit to be like people, Joanna be here. This is like people from the fresh fish fry. People from the golf, you know, league from St. Mary's. Do you want me to start telling those stories? Oh, Lord. Okay. This is for Jeannie. You got her on the line. I so. do. Jeannie. That box is for you. Okay. okay. Make sure the we got her covered. Okay. Can you see this? Yep. I don't see anything on Jeannie that. Jeannie says hello. Hello. Yeah. Hello. And, and, and then this box reluctantly, reluctantly is for Obi. And Obi's going to open his. Okay. Yeah. Which is a big mistake. I got it. Obviously, we got it at Tar J. <laughs> so, you know, we didn't we didn't spend that much money on that stuff. You know, how much for the Rolex? Yes. Yeah. Hey, stay in town. We got a Rolex with like three L's in it. <laughs> and you know, all this smack talk. He loves me. <laughs> look at this. You know, look at this. Look at that. Give me a key to the city. Yeah. Way to go. Yeah. And trust me. Trust me. This was what a lot of, like, malice and forethought. What happened to the reluctancy? 
you. Because, oh, uh, snap. Snap. Don't touch me again. We stayed here for the whole game last All night. All right. But anyway, the, the last time I gave this to a golf pro was truly somebody who was beloved. Steve Dell. Yeah. Oh, jeez. What's it really? Nobody remembers it. I do. Okay. But he was truly beloved. He was. Where Obi is kind of loved in a different way. <laughs> <laughs> As being, uh, oh, the love you know, that we, the love that we do not speak of. It'd be like, uh, it's like being a jag band. You know, <laughs> once again, and like where being, did I learn it? From? And like being a mope Billy. Where did I and learn like, it? And like, like being. Once again. Ah. Yeah. Who taught it to me? Well, I tried. I was a nice, friendly yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. gentleman. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, we, yeah. We had a, a special <laughs> relationship, you know. But anyway, there's a uh, friendship here that I'm sure will last for a while. And it's principally because of his wife. We know that. Hey! It's just okay. I'm telling the truth. We know that. It's okay. They all know that. Because the best thing that happened to him was marrying Jean. We know that too. Okay, fine. So... I won't... That'd be I, one thing I don't argue all with All right, you. so I'm going to be good now for at least 10 minutes. You're good because you already and, made your uh, <laughs> The key to the city, there's another one for Gene. I apologize, Gene. I didn't give you one when you left, but okay, we can actually give a true, you know, round of applause for Obi. <laughs> Oh, it hurt me bad. Oh, it hurt me bad. I know that it hurt you. You gotta go throw up now. I know that. It's been a long time. In a lot of ways, I even asked Jeannie six months ago, you've got more friends than you've ever had in your entire life. Are you sure you want to go? It's fine, we'll stay here, I'll deal with it. It's a long time. Never would have believed it when I told Jan Cook off the first night I was ever here. And I'd still be here. It's very bittersweet. It really is. There's a lot of reasons why I want to go. I want to do something else while I'm young enough to still do it. But I've got a lot of good people in this room. Some of them like me, some don't. But they're all good people whether I've been slept them around or not. It doesn't matter. And it's really been one hell of a run. There's going to be times in the next couple of months when I'm sitting in South Carolina with Jeannie going, God, I'm nobody again. I got people, some love me, some hate me, but I'm somebody here. And I may go to where I'm freaking nobody. Ah. And I'm kind of scared that it might happen. And I took but she said she's ready to go. She lived in Detroit and Chicago her whole life. Woo! It's time to try something new. And who the hell knows what happens <coughs> five years from now. But it's time for us to go do something different. Y'all need this place needs some new blood and need some and see what happens. And I hope it works out for you guys. Because if it all falls apart and blows up and it doesn't work out with my replacement, it's gonna hurt me. You're coming back though. Oh yeah, you never know. Oh yeah, you're coming back. It'll really you're hurt you. Coming back. But it really has hurt. been probably, yeah, probably the best 15 years of my life. So I thank everybody, and I'm gonna miss the hell out of all of you. So I really thank you for it.